This is the Fitzy and Whipper with Kate Ritchie podcast. Let's rip into this. Scary times for a 93-year-old woman. Um, she'd moved into a new house and she was wrapped that she'd been able to buy in the area, which mm. was terrific. At 93, good effort. Yeah. She's not in a home. No, mate, no. she's firing. Maybe downsizing. Possibly yeah. downsizing, yeah, to a lovely area. The thing was, once she'd moved into the home, she'd sort of settled in and after a couple of weeks or so, she started to hear a few noises under the house. Now, that can be annoying because you think, oh, my God, what have I purchased and what's living here? Um, possums. She, well, she assumed it could be possums, Kate Ritchie. Um, maybe um, maybe cats. Um, and at the wildest of times, it could be some dogs. Who knows what's going on Are under there? Are cats on heat at the moment? Because I haven't checked. No, well, I'm just Mine's saying. not. No, 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 no. There's a lot of whining going on. Oh. In the neighbourhood and cats at no. night fighting. You don't have a cat, do you? But that's not, that's no, not... but there are cats that roam around the neighbourhood. Do cats do, do they whine when they when they? Oh, they are make an for awful. Yeah, they you can, thirteen twenty four ten. If you've got your best cat on heat sound. Oh, did I just say that? Are we allowed oh. to do that? In the, does the codes? Oh. Well, Kate, Kate reenacted it earlier in the year. You might remember. It sounds like somebody what is, is it? dying. Go for it. That it's not even like a. Uh, no, like a. That's like, but it's worse than that. Where were you, you when you heard Kate Ritchie trying to reenact a cat on heat? Heat. Oh my People god! People are with me. I bet that. you they have You'll been woken up in the night listening to that. I'm so sorry. Let's move on about the noise under the house. I'm sorry, Tommy. Tom doesn't know if we've done the wrong thing. I love oh, it. Cats, on, cats on heat. It's yeah. the animal kingdom. Tom, you well did said. the sound of lions mating at the zoo. So don't pick on Kate for doing a smaller cat on heat. You're absolutely right. We won't replay that. That's fine. Where is that? We'll never, ever replay that again. No. Anyway, it turns out after she decided to call the local animal investigator who <laughs> turned up to look at what noise was coming from under the house, yeah. that there was a nude man living under the Oh, and you thought me doing the cat on heat thing was inappropriate. Could you do the a sound of a nude man for me? <laughs> under. So just under a house too. So it needs to be sort of muffled coming through the floor. No, I think he... It was- I'm, on, I'm under here in the nude. No, he'd be going, ooh, it's cold. Ooh. And then there'd be the clink of like. <laughs> Clinkers. Like um, teaspoons and stuff because he'd be making yeah. a cup of tea down I don't know there. why he was nude. The police were called, unfortunately, um, after several attempts just to chat and suggest he should hop out from under the house being nude. They got the dogs involved. He wasn't phased by that, but a little bit of tear gas will remove any nude man from under a house, I would have thought. How awful <laughs> for everyone involved. <laughs> Love to know what did the scary noise turn out to be? So while you're lying in bed and you're thinking, what the hell is going on under there? Actually, just see if you can find... We had the anger... No, we had the possum, the, the mother possum defending oh, yeah. her child. Have you heard a possum get quite angry? Yeah. That is a scary, mm-hmm. scary sound. Hey, possums! No, 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 not that no, one. No, no, I had one at the door <laughs> once when I went away for the weekend. It was scratching. Yeah, there it is. What, you had an angry possum? What is that? That what is, is scary. That? Jesus. That's a nude man <laughs> under the Jesus. house. Um, That's the resurrection. Sarah's in Manly Vale. You heard a noise and you were terrified. Is that right, Sarah? Hi, guys. Yeah, um, my husband was away for the night and I woke up in the middle of the night absolutely terrified. Very strange noise outside. So, you know, got the knife from the kitchen, had a look. I was like, what the hell? And I opened the door and there's a possum bum up in the dog biscuit barrel rummaging around. (sighs) Oh, and what did you do? (laughs) (laughs) Are you out of bed yet? I was convinced that it was a murderer. So Yeah, Yeah. Yeah. I know what you mean. I've never grabbed a knife from the kitchen. Like, that's full on. Yeah, when you turn up with a knife, my God, that poor possum. What knife would you go with, Kate? Would you go the bread... Bread knife? You, no, you no, go, I'd go the, the fillet. The I'd go the Japanese filleting oh, knife. Geez. Yeah, you well, gotcha. they got one of those. Quite you? long. Shivers. Pointy. Katie in Castle Hill, what was the scary noise, Katie? 
Uh, well, my husband was away interstate and I wasn't expecting him home at all. He drove home from Melbourne overnight and I heard footsteps through the house at 2am that did not sound like toddlers. And I was like, I'm going to be killed. But it was actually just him arriving home. <laughs> and were you angry with him rather than saying, oh, honey, it's so nice that you've surprised me? Were you just filthy? Yes. I was like, what the hell are you doing? And I was so scared and wired. I couldn't go to sleep. And then he just... Hopped into bed and was like, well, I'm tired. And yeah. went straight no. off to sleep. Yeah, he could have given you the heads up that he was on the way home. Thanks, Katie. Shay in Glenwood, what did the scary noise end up being, Shay? We were in my boyfriend's house and underneath there were like 20 cats just having sex. And Kate is so right. The sound is awful. Yeah. Can you do one? Can you do the sound, Shay? Absolutely Shay? not. <laughs> what do we have See, to go you back have, to Kate's You have higher standards than I do, Shay. <laughs> so, I, mean, I wasn't doing... I wasn't... That, that sound wasn't them in the act. That no. was the sound of them looking for people within the neighbourhood. Yeah, you yeah. know? Thank God. What yeah. Is, I mean, this, they are very different. <laughs> What's what's more sad though that the sound of the cats going for it or Kate crying because she's not getting? <laughs> oh my god! I hope there's a meeting after nine o'clock about this. <laughs> Do you mean cats? Kate's under the house. Do you know what? Is there, is Do you know what, Fizzy? I what think you that's mean? you being very presumptuous. Yeah, I mean, I'm assuming. I mean, I'm... I can't. Why? I thought we were talking about a nude ma- man. Uh, man. Uh, <laughs> Man under the house. Under your house? No, if only. No. <laughs> That's the thing. <laughs> and, if, and if you could change a light bulb as well, that would be very handy. Sits in Whipper with Kate Ritchie is a Nova podcast. For more great shows like this, download the Nova Player via the App Store or Google Play. The Nova Player.